Ill. Oh. I don't know, man. The energy's kind of dropped a little bit. Maybe the Q&A. Let me try again. The people at the back, we need your energy, yeah? Bring it. Okay? Eel. Oh. Eel. Oh. Eel. Eel. Oh. Once upon a time, a man walked with his wife across the African plains. She had a baby tied across her back. He carried his bow, his arrows, and his spears. As they walked and walked, he saw up ahead a herd of bush cattle. He turned to his wife. I've just realized I need my hands for this. Can I ask you to hold this microphone? Sorry. Sorry. If you go down, then you won't be able to You won't be a distraction to my audience. Okay. Eel. 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 In the distance, he saw a herd of bush cattle. And he turned to his wife and he said, Woman. You have the ability to change yourself into a leopardess. I am hungry. Change yourself into a leopardess now. Chase down that herd of bush cattle. Bring me one bush calf. Bring it back. Change yourself back into a woman. Skin it, clean it, cook it, prepare it the way I like it, and serve it to me. She said, my husband, you are a hunter. You have your bow, you have your arrow, you have your spear. I'm carrying my child. The way has been very, very, very tiring. Why do you not hunt? He said, I am your husband. If I tell you to hunt, you will hunt. If I tell you to change yourself into a leopardess, you will. I tell you to chase down a herd of bush cattle, you will. I tell you to bring a calf, you will. I tell you to come back, change back into a woman, you will. I tell you to clean and skin the animal and prepare it the way I like it, you will. Because I am your husband and my word and my will rules here. And she said, okay, if you insist. If you insist. And she untied the baby from her back and she laid the baby gently down on the ground. That woman, that woman, her eyes became the eyes of a leopard. That woman, that woman, her skin became the fur of a leopard and her teeth became the teeth of a leopard and her hands became the paws of a leopard and her back became the back of a woman and her heart became the heart of a woman and she turned to her husband and she said Rah! and that man he ran he ran he ran he ran he ran to the nearest tree and up into the nearest tree he went and he clung onto that tree <laughs> and that leopardess she circled around that tree and she looked up and she said <laughs> and he clung and he clung to that tree and zoop, she was off she ran and she ran and she ran she ran towards that herd of bush calf she turned the herd this way she turned the herd that way she turned the herd that way she turned the herd this way the youngest one the slowest one he couldn't keep up with the herd she pounced she tore its throat open and she dragged its body back to the tree. That woman, that leopard woman, her back became the back of a woman. That woman, that leopard woman, her paws became the hands of a woman and her fur became the skin of a woman and her teeth became the teeth of a woman and her eyes became the eyes of a woman and her heart became the heart of a woman and that woman she made a fire and that woman she took a knife and she skinned that bush cattle that bush calf and she threw the skin and the entrails to one side and the vultures descended that woman she found a long strong stick and she pushed it pushed it through the body of that bush calf she made a spit and she turned and she roasted and she turned and she roasted and she turned and she roasted the meat. And when the meat was done to a turn, she took that knife and she cut a piece of meat from that bush calf. And she looked up at the husband and she said, husband, your meal is ready. And he said, ah, 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 ah. she said, husband, your meal is ready. Ah, 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 ah. And then the baby began to cry. She laid the meat down, she picked up the child, she lifted her blouse, she latched her child to her breast. 
And it was only when she latched the child to the breast that her husband recognized and trusted her. And so he came down from the tree, snatched up the meat, and he ate the meat all this while watching her nervously as she nursed her child and sang lullabies. The child happy, she replaced her blouse, and then her husband said, woman, put out the fire, wrap up the meat, we have to go. She said, certainly my husband. She put out the fire, she wrapped up the meat, she tied the baby to her back, she tied the meat to the front and then she said, husband, before we go, there's something I must say. My name is woman. I am capable of anything you ask of me. So next time, be careful what you ask. And that is the end of that story. Thank you. Thank you.